What's up, YouTube? It's I'm Drew. Hey, We're slow as mixed up. I'm bringing you guys back another little commentary right here. In this story, mm, it's like a story time, uh, I guess I could get that. You know, hashtag you know it's just talking about my memory, so it's about, you know, f flashback, 7th grade Drew. You know, right? still got my OG gamer tag playing Infinite Warfare, I think, or it was. The Division, the first Rather Division. Dead. It was one of those games. Maybe BO3 I was playing. I don't know. It was one of those three games. So I was playing that, you know, I was just chilling. So, you know, I was just enjoying life. You know, I was just playing basketball in middle school. And, you know, just going to school, having fun. And at that time, I was kind of like, I was kind of a hoe. But not really. Like, I didn't, like, play girls. I just, like, I would get with a lot of girls during my 17th and 8th grade year. Or I would just talk to them, like, flirtatious, you know, lead them on for a little bit. Then you like... Like chill out. I don't know. I felt like a hoe, and so I just like stopped all that. You know, now that I've you know grown up, you know, fast forward. Now I'm a junior in high school, but you know, fast forward. You know, I stopped all that. But anyways, like, anyway. So basically, the story is about I caught. It was two years in a row that it happened too. One year I was there, and one year I wasn't there. And this is why I didn't like my middle school. Because the kids were fucking weird and nasty and annoying. And just, in there. So it was like, one day, it was just a good day. I wake up early, you know, I actually wake up on time because I used to wake up late and miss the bus all the time. I have to get a ride. Even though it was like less than a mile away, but my mom, she wouldn't let me walk to school or whatever. So I was like, I wake up on time. It's a good day. I, you know, I make myself breakfast because I want to, you know, learn how to cook when I was young and stuff. So anyways... I gotta go. Get to school. First period, it's the breeze. I didn't really have to do anything in there. I had a 99 average in there. So I didn't really do anything. Go to athletics second period, get a good workout in. So I'm, you know, I'm coming out, I'm feeling great. Fast forward, it's after lunch. You know, I sit with one of the girls that were, you know, I was talking to or whatever, I was just like being flirtatious with or whatever. Let's go. And, you know, watching my seventh period class started. Hey, it's all I'll good, die. you know. Talking to my friends, having a good time, doing my work, or whatever. It's just a good day. But then, what I ate at lunch, it was like these, like corn, mini corn dogs, or whatever. And I don't know why, but it was just this day. This day, those mini corn dogs, they freaking messed my stomach up so bad. It was like I was just getting punched in the stomach. Somebody was like, like somebody's hand was like in my stomach, just squeezing it. That like it hurt so freaking bad. Like, I was just, like, groaning. I was like, like, mm, like, ow. Like, uh, it was hurting. I saw that. So I figured out, I was like, oh, well, I got to use the restroom. Let's go. So I asked my teacher. She says, yes. I walk out to the restroom. And first restroom I walk in, okay, I find the these kids boy. smoking weed. So I'm like, <laughs> fuck that. I don't, I don't have time to meal. sit in there, get the weed smell on me, and you know, then have, you know, one of the principals be like, hey, why you, you smell like weed? Come to my office or whatever. Because, one, for one, I, I've never done drugs or anything. I'm a good guy. I'm a little innocent. I'm a, a little innocent kid. Not a nerd, but, you know. I know stuff, but I won't do drugs because I just don't mess with that. So, like, anyways, I go to the all the way across the restaurant. So, it was like, the where our school was, it was, like, a middle place, the 8th grade hall, 7th grade hall. So, I'm in the 7th grade hall. So, I walk all the way to the 8th grade hall because they had a better restroom first off. So, I'll go in there, right? Go in there, right? about to go do my business right can't even do that so like i go in there go in the little stall because like the first stall you know for some reason no one goes in there so i'm just sitting there about to pull my pants down I'm right not to accidentally call it so then i like i sit down right i look at my shoes right and uh corner of my eye i see not like one pair of shoes i see like three pairs of shoes in the big stall so i'm like what the fuck I'm like, so i'm thinking like okay more kids in there smoking or whatever but I don't care because my stomach hurts. So I do my business, you know, <laughs> you know, all that business. I finish or whatever. And then I start hearing like moaning, like, mm, like moaning. <laughs> I don't know why I tried to do that. But I hear him moaning. So I'm like, what the hell? And then like, you know, it gets louder and, you know, you just start hearing like, like they're, they're really having sex in the restroom. So I was like, why would y'all do the most fucked up shit in the restroom? It's not I even a, like the two kids. Yeah. They're having a threesome. And eighth, they're eighth graders. That was seventh grade. So I was like, what the hell are y'all doing? So I walk out, right? I try to get out of there as fast as possible because it looks weird in there. So I see my friends and they're just walking around. I'm like, yo, they fucking in the restroom. 
<laughs> it was so funny, bro. They were like, no, nah, you're lying. I was like, go in there. They went in there. They come back out. They're just dying laughing, right? And then one of the vice principal sees us. They're like, hey, go to class. Then he goes in the restroom because then he saw my friends walk out. And then next thing you know, I'll come in the next day. They're like, they're like, yo, so and so looking for you. Like, you snitch. I was like, what? I don't snitch. You know, I didn't say anything to the principal. And they're like, no, they're looking for you because they got in trouble. They got caught. Having sex in the restroom with so and so. I was like, oh, so and so? It was the finest girl in, in uh, the eighth grade. She was like, prettiest girl ever. Now she's like, mm -hmm. but anyways, I was like, why are they looking for me? Anyways, they never found me because I was oh, a ninja. Oh, I, I, got me. I wasn't trying to get jumped either, too. Hey, Even though I had my boys back me up, still wasn't trying to get jumped, anyways. <laughs> so, anyways, that's basically it. The they were just caught having sex in the restroom the and they all got suspended. <laughs> One of them stayed in cap for the rest of the year, and that's like the middle of the year. I was like, "What you do? I for what?" Uh, I guess he got caught Miss doing something else, so but much. you know that was really it. So, um, anyways, Let's go. 60 and two. hope you enjoyed that little story. It's my first time doing a little story time or whatever. That was some really like, weird stuff. Uh, anyways, hopefully I enjoyed that video. Um, let me know bro. if y'all want to hear more weird stories that I have. They're not really like weird that's stories. Cool. Just more. Crazy stuff that has happened to me, but um, yeah. Hopefully, I enjoyed this video. Like, sub, share for more. It's been I'm George. Slow as next level. That and, was uh, fun. Have a good day. Hope you enjoyed the gameplay too. I'm out. Peace. The K Bar Bunker Buster.